Hello everybody! So, today I thought I'd film, um, blah. Today I thought I'd film a haul type video, uh, so I'm going to show you all the stuff I've got for my baby so far. Depending on how long this takes me, I might split it into two, but I'll do it all in one and see how it is. Also, quick note, I am filming this video back to back from the one that I've just uploaded, um, so that's why I look the same, I am not just wearing the same clothes every day of my life. Yeah, so I'm going to show you uh, the clothes I've got so far, and the items, baby items I've got so far. I really enjoy watching other people's hauls, especially baby clothes hauls and stuff like that. I can't be the only person to enjoy it, so I thought I'd make my own. And yeah, so I hope you enjoy. Right, so hello guys. Um, I'm going to start off with showing you the clothes I've got first. So at the moment they are in these two little things, which doesn't look like much, I know. Um, because I'm not living where I'm going to be living currently when I have the baby, so I've not got a nursery set up or anything, so I've just sort of put them neatly into these little baskets. Um, so this little basket, that's just like a boofal toy thing. But I've got um, little socks here, and then scratch mitts here, um, my hats, and then bibs, and then right down the bottom is some muslin cloths, so that's just this little basket for that stuff at the moment. And then in this box here, I've got all my sleep suits and body suits and some little outfits. So I'm not going to get them all out because they're all folded up nicely. But yeah, I've got some different patterned sleep suits and then a bunch of white ones. Uh, same for the body suits, but they're mostly white and I've got some little leggings and t-shirts which are right at the bottom um, if you want to see them you can go and look at my 18 week video because I think I show some of them there so I think like sleep suit and bodysuit wise and little outfit wise I'm pretty much set for 0 to 3 Um, and I've also got some little items downstairs, which I've made myself. So I've made them a hat, mittens and booties, uh, a jumper and some little trousers. But I might save the handmade stuff for a separate video. So that's it for... Wait, no it's not. That is not it for zero to three. Because... <laughs> okay, right. So I also have this snowsuit as my baby is going to be a winter baby. So I have this really cute, soft snowsuit with little mittens, little teddy ears, which is really cute. Um, yeah, and the stuff I've made is for zero to three. Um, I'm expecting people will probably buy me stuff, so I might get some more. But that is it for zero to three. I'm trying to be as minimal as possible because I know how fast babies grow. Um, I've also got a Mama's and Papa's sleep bag, which is zero to three, I think. Um, or zero to six. And it's 2.5 tog for my winter child. <laughs> um, so, oh dear, right. In this Moses basket, I've got this all out of the spare room, so it's a total chaotic mess. I hope someone appreciates this. Um, <laughs> okay, so this Moses basket is borrowed, or no, second hand, from my cousin. Um, this is going to stay at my mum's house for if we stay over. 
I've got a brand new Moses basket, but it's in the box. But I will show you that when we move into our flat and I do the nursery. Um, so in this basket, I've got um, a little jacket with a hood with some ears on, which is really cute. Um, this is three to six months, though, so I'm not sure if it will fit them straight away. It depends on how big my baby is. Um, underneath there, I've got some really cool bodysuits, which are like tattoo themed. Um, I show them in my 18 week video if you want a closer look at them and to hear where I got them from. But yeah, they're really cool and they're size 3 to 6 as well. Um, I've also got a free, oh, 6 to 12 sleep bag, which has got Snoopy on. So, and I think this is also 2.5 tog, so I might have to get a less, the 1.5 tog maybe, for summer, because otherwise they're going to be way too hot. Um, uh, clothes wives, for the three to six months I've just got a free pack of bodysuits. And a two pack of sleep suits, so not much, but I'm expecting people to buy me clothes. Well, I'm not expecting it, but I expect people want to give me a gift, so if they buy me clothes, I'll tell them to get three to six. Um, and I'll probably buy more once the baby's born, because it's quite hard to get all gender neutral stuff all the time. Um, so in this, was this basket, I've got a little stash of things. I've got this cot bed starter kit, um, which has got a fitted sheet, a flat sheet, and a fleece blanket. Oh, I said that weird. Blanket. Blanket. So that's for the cot bed. Um, for the Moses basket, I've got two fitted sheets. I will probably get more of these, though. Um... And then there's there's a fleecy blanket for the Moses basket, um, a pram blanket. And this looks exactly the same, but giant. And then there's a blanket here that's from my mum. I think she had that one. She had me. Um, so I might not be using those blankets if they have the sleep bag, but it's just in case, and I can use it elsewhere as well. Um, and here is a wrap, a baby wrap. So. You wrap the baby in it and carry it on you, like that woman there. Uh, this is actually being given to me from... Uh, <sighs> my mum's husband's son's wife. So that was nice of her to lend that to me. Um, and she also lent me some books which are currently up there. So, yep. And in this bag, I've got a ginormous Philips Advent starter kit, which, um, sorry about the rustling, uh, has all of this in it. Um, I plan on breastfeeding, but obviously if I want to express, the bottles are handy. And... Yeah, it, I got it really cheap because it was 50% off and I had vouchers, so I only paid 15 quid for it, which I thought was pretty good, considering all that you get. Um, and in this little bag here, this is, in this bag here is what my mum has got me. My mum's got me... <laughs> quite a lot of stuff actually already so she is wonderful um so she's just got me some bits and bobs um sponges for the bath um cotton wool pads pseudocrim pampers wipes and Huggies wipes and also an all-in-one baby wash and
and she also has gotten me a trial top spots easy fit nappy so I am planning on cloth nappying my baby um, I've been doing a lot of research about which ones to get um, but she got me this one quite a while ago which is an all-in-one I believe or slight like an all-in-one slash pocket nappy um, it's super cute I love the pattern on it they're quite expensive though I think it was like 10 pound um, so that's good and I think I will be using pocket nappies when they get a bit bigger and I'll be using a fitted two-piece system when they are small so yeah um, so yeah so far this is my little stash of stuff um, so I think that's it for now I do have a few other little items but I will probably save those until I can do a nursery tour and it's going to be a bit of a long video so I will cut it here uh, let me know if you enjoyed this type of video and be sure to subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you guys in another video very soon so bye